Welcome back everyone to episode 5 of Dyson Sphere program and I guess without further ado let's just get into it. So we finished researching the improved logistics system last time and now we get a splitter, a four-way splitter actually and a sorter mark 2 that's just a bit more quickly and I've been thinking of uh, automating... Uh, actually I can't... can I automate steel? with these basic uh, smelting facilities? I can, okay so probably should start doing this, we need three of them so I kinda feel like we need... oh that's not what I wanted to do that's not what I wanted to do okay we do have some spare production here right but it's not like a lot more probably should build another mining machine and fully um, use it for producing steel so do we get all we don't cannot get all of them nope can get everyone except uh, this way, one more. Ah, it's one. One we cannot get, but I think this is a good, good position. And probably should do. Let's see what we can. What what's there is to build? So we probably should automate buildings, but we cannot do them yet. So those Tesla towers need to be handcrafted, like big quality and crafted every single one of them so let's do them let's do a few of them we can stockpile a few okay that's that dealt with and on the mean time we can start the production shall I just do it this way Build smelters here. Like the farthest I can put is this one. Lack of item. Okay, no problem. We will just see how many we need later. These are the fast ones, right? So probably I should use them. like this then we put them out do we i don't need them here right i can just put them next to each other yeah that should be doable that should actually be doable okay next research energy matrix nice you have the next energy matrix yes we're gonna do that then after we, we are producing steel, we can start doing... No, we need some more smelters. It's like 10 of them. We need more electronics. Magnetic coils and circuit boards. Still haven't figured out how I can get something that's on the ground like just grab it we are lacking steel would probably be best if I can grab faster is that the problem Probably is the problem, right? We can remove this and upgrade to the faster one and see if that helps with circuit production. 
Kinda does, kinda does. Kinda does. But it's still... Because I need twice as many iron ingots and copper. That's why it's only this one that, that's kinda lacking. Probably good to to put the buffer chest there. So regardless of backing up here, I can still produce or pack up some steel or iron ingots, sorry. Probably be a good idea. Probably should fix that later. So, and then this should be possible, right? This works, nice. Okay, let's put them onto iron ingots production. And these to steel. Sixty per minute. I need to connect them first. Otherwise there is no it's too close. It's too close. Should have expected that. Should have expected that. So we do one layer of space in between and put them here and do steel production. How much does it need? and it's doing 20 roughly 20 per minute so if I can plus one of okay this produces three times as many the problem is would it be useful to have more Does help. You're at roughly 20. It's it's jump back and forth. So this actually works, right? The math isn't totally off here. Like this, and then we can start bringing them into our production system, right? Let's keep him here for a moment and see how we are going to deal with it. Connect this together. Steel production, steel production, and hook them up. Ah. I always keep on clicking the right mouse button and deselecting that stuff. So would it be worthwhile to... No. Okay, we are at our limits. Of energy. We do kinda need a lot more. Maybe I should just not produce more graphite. This should increase... The throughput rate of the coal, right? Everything is getting snagged right now, but we can do another one of these, no problem here. We can use, try to use these. Good now, do I really have to connect it this way? And a scuffed. Okay. Now let's try this. You go in here, you go in here, and you go further. I could probably keep on doing graphite now, right? Probably would be able to. Let's keep it that way for now, and let's see electricity, satisfaction. 
more than met. More than met. Let's grab these so we can research further. I actually forgot that. Pretty lame. And we could... Let me see. Do I have a storage box? I don't. Okay. Storage box. Let's create two of them. What is this coal, right? Coal, yes, okay, yeah. After we have finished this one, we can just put it over here. Core energy low. Yep. Oh, C it was. C. And then let's hook up this one for the time being. So we can start collecting these just for times of need. So we have already collected some of them. Now, these are going to do blue research, right? So probably then need steel and something else that's like a resource, right? Components, steel probably, maybe some plasma, I don't know. Plasma refining, I don't, I can get oil now. But I haven't seen an oil deposit. What is this? This looks like something from the ground. Oh boy. Come on. Do I have something? Do I have some spare materials I can use to fuel myself a bit? Yes, I have. Just until we get. Oh. Or we take these. But I think these are definitely useful graphite. Because you get triple or double the amount of energy. For the space you would need coal for if you have it in your inventory. But let's get ourselves some charge. Get ourselves some charge. Research is nearly finished. Let's see. Um, basic chemical engineering, deuterium fractionation. Okay, what's that? It's the high vapor pressure ration of liquid hydrogen. Okay, this is some fuel stuff. Probably even more advanced than graphite energy source. Solar panels, green energy, crystal silicon, diamonds. Diamonds advanced, okay. Need lots of these. And terraforming, okay. Up here is titanium. Oh, that's what we already have a bit from. What else we got here? Unlocks electromagnetic turbine, nice. We've nearly finished this one, so let's just get to produce red ones. Need to see what we need for that. Okay, this helped. Kinda. Now I have an overflux. Definitely producing more than we need right now. Everything's on reserve here. And those deals are getting stored as well. So. Let's just increase our store store storage. So what we can research this while we find out what we need for red ones. We do need graphite and hydrogen, okay. Graphite and hydrogen. So I'm thinking I'm thinking we should Okay, of course, everything is now kind of convoluted here. So, maybe I bring them over here. My gravit production here. And link it directly. Probably should build another one, right? One that's dedicated to, to the red ones. Okay. So, we need a new f research facility. We don't have one access. 
Nope. Well, no, where is it? This one. We need some glass. Some glass. Some circuit boards and some magnetic coils. Now the problem is I'm actually not stockpiling these two, right? So that's something I can do actually. Let us put... What's this? Storage. Yes, storage. Over here. And connect these two. So we can start getting some without effort. That should be enough, right? Glass. We need more glass. Didn't I build glass just now? I didn't have... I didn't have enough, okay. I should automate doing glass, right? Yep. Yeah. Should automate that. Let's produce this one. And then... Get over there. We have more than enough stone here, so why not just... What do I need? An assembler, right? Assembler. <laughs> more circuit boards, okay. Probably should have checked what I need before going there. Let's get these one to the inventory. Gonna need them anyways later. So, we are going to build an assembler. Let's just do two, right? Let's do two. Ooh, this takes a lot of a lot of time. Can I do research later without having the items in my inventory? Maybe that would actually be nice. So after this, we can research semiconductors. Semiconductors aren't they like the greatest achievement human can has ever done? Like. I think I've heard or read that somewhere that like the semiconductor was like the the biggest technological like jumpstart to, to a new era or something like wasn't that kind of the case? I'm I'm not so sure actually right now. Maybe I'm I'm just stupid and I misheard that somewhere. But I thought it was something on the line, something like that. Okay, I need another storage would be good in the meantime we can connect a tesla tower so we do have electricity here <laughs> dude my space looks so convoluted it's, it's like actually who's even building here who's even building here there's no clue about aesthetics and we do glass i can't even do glass do we need a smelter Probably it, right? Would make sense to glass you gain from, yeah, you gain it from sand or like, yeah, sand, crushed stones. Why didn't I think of that? So let's actually see what else we can build in an assembler so we can. I need, elect oh, no, I need electricity. So we are producing this, this, this. We don't produce this at the moment we would need glass we can do that so we can produce these and then doesn't that we can actually do this why didn't I why did I think I can do them last time I've already have everything here I need right assembler got it here doing electric motors and connecting this works actually works okay 
kind of always have to do stuff later because I'm thinking ahead. The question now is, do we have enough production of iron here? So I could actually build another smelter just for iron. Probably should do, just to, to make sure that the that, uh, stuff is not uh, getting uh, wherever here. That's this one dealt with, and we are putting. Uh, dude, why do I have problems finding my stuff here? Like, I could just use them, right? Probably should start using them because it's already showing me how much I have from everything. So, storage, building. I definitely should start using the menu down there. Okay. This. Iron ingots. Roads, button, sorters, here and here, and electricity. Just connect it here, so we have enough. We can still upgrade to the other side, right? So, oh, gonna need another one of these. One of these days, I probably should start, like, actually calculating how much I need to actually optimize everything, but I kinda don't feel like getting into it right now I feel like just adding one is like the solution right now and then later we can start about optimizing like actually that's like that little bit that's not connected to it okay we have more than enough coal more than enough coal that's that steel and we said we want to producing stone ah that's the problem yeah didn't think of that one yep okay so we can connect A smelter here right on this side and this way I have electricity here and yeah, that would be nice actually like this stone I'm I'm gathering here so put it in should I bring them up probably should bring them up so let's just start with this and let's get another road another conveyor belt system up and running like this connect it not enough electricity no problemo no problemo amigo oh another one yeah just to be safe. Amigo. Okay, now we have enough. Let's start by connecting now. This side should be fine, right? Yeah, that should be okay. I actually need them to be faster, right? Probably should invest in upgrades now, rather than research more buildings and technologies. Because this takes forever, man. Like, get the move on drones, please. Kinda wanna finish that. Should I split it here? Come on, they're really slow. Come on, guys. Kinda wanna do red matrix. Cubes research, red research in this episode. Got that one going. Yeah. Come on, build it. Q. 
Okay. Got it over here. So what, what did we need? We needed... Graphite. And... Hydrogen. Graphite and hydrogen. And hydrogen, we are researching, right? Chemical plant? No, we are not. We have it already, don't we? Oil extractor, oil refinery. No, it's not this one. Fuel. Water pump. Storage. Water pumping facility. Facility used to collect liquid resource from an ocean including water and sulfuric acid. Where do I get hydrogen? Hydrogen. Crude oil and more advanced chemical products. Where is this actually? Accelerant Mark 1. Storage, water pump. We don't we don't have it, right? Energy storage, photon frequency processors. Polymer chemicals. It can't be something I need red research for. So let's I haven't actually played around with uh You know what? Let's get this going again. Mm. Let the uh, let's put one here. Do this conveyor. This is more iron, right? Yes, okay. Probably shouldn't block this off, maybe go around. Um, we need to connect this over here. Build some graphite and put it out. Um, around here. Good. It's probably still too close, but... You can do one after another there, so should be fine. Nice, okay. Now, let's try fiddling around a bit with these water, water pump. Where do we have it here? Let's build the water pump. Needs electricity. Which it should have now, any second. Come on, guys, where are you at? Back there somewhere, okay. Let's not research semiconductors, so let's go to upgrades. Drones, drones. Construct, unlocks one more construction drone. Dro drone flight speed, let's do this one. You. Uh, nope. Later. Okay, it's pumping water now. Question is a bit... How do I... It's not... It's not this, right? Choose facility, no. Okay, do we have... Something to connect it with? Oil extractor, oil refinery... Matrix lab, no. What do we need it actually for right now? What do we need water for? Can't say yet. But we have it in your inventory. It can be obtained from a water pump and while using chemical production. Yes, we have it now, but I don't actually know what we need it for. As of right now. Okay. Let's see where we can do hydrogen. We, we gotta... We gotta know. We gotta know. Criterium. Maybe a pressurization of liquid hydrogen, liquid deuterium at a certain temperature. And this one is. Okay, we need 
Ne, Deuterium, Hydrogen, it's not the same. Lot. I'm stupid. Definitely stupid. Where do where can I extract that stuff? Prism. Should I just build one? I haven't built it. I haven't built one yet, right? So glass. For sure, glass. I didn't do uh, storage for that one. Okay. Then let's put one here just so we have one for the time being. Storage here and road. Nope. Like this. Oh, we need electricity again for that. Where is electricity stored here? Ah, uh, here, okay. Put that one here and get some glass. Nice. So we wanted to put this prisma plus two. But I don't know a polygon surrounded by two intersecting glass planes. You can split light or disperse light beams. It is a key component of producing more precise optical instruments. No clue where I need it for. What we were ah, I probably should upgrade our production of those. It needs those motors. So I need to get stuff out of here. I'm connected with this one and build an assembly. Probably build an assembly. And see what it's got going for itself. Buildings, yes, I can actually do them. And I can produce them here. Why did I? Or did I just unlock them? Because I researched something. That's probably it. So I can now automate building production. That's actually nice. Okay, a bit of a long episode compared to the other ones, but I think it was worth it. We did quite some progress here, but still I need to find out how to produce hydrogen. So probably off screen I will do some research. Either go and read a bit more up here in game, or if I can't find out I just have to look it up online. So we can start producing some right research matrices over here. Well anyways, thanks again for watching. Um, if you liked it, please subscribe and consider clicking the ring bell. So you will get notified whenever I upload something. Other than that, comment if you have anything you want me to improve. If you see any flaws, I can do better. So I can improve my video quality and production quality. And yeah, that's for this episode. I wish you a very nice day or evening, wherever you are. And goodbye. See you the next time. Thank you.